Hey y'all, this is Coasters and Travels, and I'm back here at Bush Gardens Tampa Bay. Sand Serpent will be closing its last day, will be on July 9th. So I'm just here to pay my respects. Let's take a ride. Welcome to the Sand Serpent. So I just got off of this ride here. And yeah, I mean, it is what it is. It's a wild mouse coaster and whatnot, but it was fun. And I'm gonna miss it when it's gone. I think I can only do one ride. That line is a little bit long for me to waiting. The dispatch is not bad, but one ride is enough. But there's one thing I wanna show you. All right, so this is the Pantopia Theater. And the only thing they use it for is a show called Rescue Tales. And next to the Pantopia Theater is the ride Sand Serpent. And What's next to what used to be next to Sand Serpent and this purple fence is where Phoenix used to be, the old flat ride. So my theory from the last video, if you saw it, was if they repurpose this and combine it with this land and then the purple land over there, you know, you got a lot of space to make a pretty cool dark ride if they choose to go that direction. It would be nice if we were to get, you know, something family friendly and something that like it's in inside like an indoor coaster that would be very wonderful for the park because it gets hot as hell here so having something to reprieve from the heat or even in the rain will be a great addition to this gardens tampa so coming in from a different angle this is where phoenix used to be and it's a pretty decent space especially if you combine it with sand serpent and the theater over here you can make something pretty substantial you know what while we're here let's take a tour of the rest of pantopia so as you can see here, that's San Serpent, and to the left of that is the Pantopia Theater. Right here is the big carousel, you know, for the kids. Up here is Falcon's Fury, which is supposed to be open, but it's not open right now. All right, and this is Bush Flyers, one of the few kitty rides in this area, really only the few flat rides in this area. And over here is where the gang sections are, where they have different carnival games. Got some machines here, like an arcade inside over there, and just games, you know, to spend money on. So Pantopia is home to two food places. The first one is Twisted Tails Pretzels. I recently just got a cinnamon pretzel. They're pretty good. The other place is Dragonfire. They have a dining area over here. And then on the other side, they have like a seating area slash stage where they have live shows. All right, so right next to Dragonfire is one of the oldest coasters in the park, Scorpion. And we have a car coming up right now.
I think that's it for this video. I just wanted to give my quick respect to Sand Serpent since it will be closing very, very soon. Whatever comes in this place, I hope it will breathe more life into the Pantopia area. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can get notified of my latest videos. And I'll see you next time. Take care.